Feeling blue without you Give me one more chance Give me one more dance Feel Hi guys, welcome to this episode with Charlie That's me How y'all doing today? So today Obviously a little different. I dipped into my Fenty stuff. Again. This is a lipstick that I just thought I'd try out today. It's very different. I don't wear colored lipsticks like this and I normally never do any blue in my eyes at all, but I think it looks really pretty. Uh, the lipstick is Clapback. Or no. No. I'm wrong. I have that one. It's not that one. This one is Turks and Caicos. Hmm. Tells you tells you how much I wear. First time. Alright. Well, today we are going to get into numero dos of my BoxyCharm face boxes. And this is my second box of the month. You guys know I get two every month to compare what I get, what comes in, and see the differences. I always hope for different items. That way I'm never getting the same thing. I keep what I want, and the stuff I don't, I sell or give away. BoxyCharm, the base box is $25 a month, and that's what this one is. So, let's get started. Do, 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 do. I'm really feeling this makeup today. Like, it may not match me. It may not be my thing. I'm no, I was never the goth kid, but I'm enjoying me a blue moment. Cause I got like blue, blue, goldish, and like this really pinky, cute coral color. So you know what? I've been digging it. Ooh, okay. Okay. So we all know from my last video, I chose the iron for both my base boxes and guess what I got the yellow one in this box and it's my favorite color yep this is staying I love that little curling iron okay next in here is something I'm not really that interested in something I probably won't use because I have so many of these already it is a pair of eyebrow tweezers I can get this open. So I stopped shaving my eyebrows and stuff and I've been letting them grow out and I've only been plucking them like once every couple of weeks so they grow back in and they grew back in a lot thicker than they were before. But a lot nicer. So these are made by Chella. Okay. We got these cute little finger grip thingies going on. I guess it's just most to make it easier while you do your face. A pair of tweezers is a pair of tweezers. I didn't get an information card in this box either. I also didn't get the digital card for this. Um, it seems like BoxyCharm's really messing up lately as far as making sure their stuff goes out appropriately packed, prepped, and ready to go. So, can't tell you how much any of this is worth. Because, uh, no card. Sorry, guys. Next in the box is a Becca product. This is something I definitely wasn't expecting. It is the Ultimate Lip Definer pencil. Let's see what color we got. I know they had like eight options or so of this. Oh, okay. So it's like, it's like a very pretty nudish pink. Its name is Toasty. Looks like, so it's got a sharpener on the bottom end you can take in, you can take out. And it also has a little twisty cap you can take off. If I can get it off. And it's got this little tool at the end for making sure your stuff's right. So I will definitely keep this because this cute little nudie color can go with every single color in my Jeffree Star Mini Lip Nude Bundle. Adorable. Best part is it's a little twist up, so that works great for me. 
honestly, good color. That I could use with just about any of them, honestly. Next in my box. Ooh. So here's something a lot of people have been going nuts over in the BoxyCharm groups that I'm in. People really, really like this. I love this. I need to give this a try and see how much I like this. But this is the Very Cherry Clean Pharmacy Make Away or Makeup Melt Away Cleansing Balm. I was like, he's a little too big for my hand to like block off everything, but I'm going to open this and I'm going to smell it because I'm going to keep it. Ooh, that's good. This, it smells like maraschino cherries. I love that. Ooh. Yep. I'm going to keep this. This is going to go in my shower. I'm going to use this to try and take off my makeup tonight. We'll see how that goes. Ooh, guess who's excited? I love this thing. Like I said, everybody in my groups and stuff are going crazy over this. Apparently not a lot of people got this in their boxes, and they're very upset about not getting this, so they're trying to buy it off of people. So, that's definitely a keep for me. That's item four, the very last item. Is that four? One, two, three, four. Yeah, it's four. Very last item in my box. I got this in my other box, just like I got the curling iron. This is one of the Hank and Henry palettes. It's living in color. I'm not going to open this and show you guys this because I opened it and showed it to you guys in my other video. It's a really pretty nine pan shadow kit. Uh, it's got very, very thick packaging. For as big as this palette is, the pan size is really, really small on the inside. And the colors, there's four shimmers and, no, five shimmers and uh, four mattes that are in there. And they're all like darker colors too, so they're not, it says living in color, it's really not that bright of a palette. So if you're into neutrals and not bright, dark dingy type colors like if you're not into the colors it's on my lips or the color right here in my in a corner not for you sorry girlfriend um that was short sweet simple and cute so I guess quick recap and uh, I'll guess my prices you can tell me if I'm wrong and I probably am so this I did go online and find out how much this is worth. This is $50. That's $50. This has a sale price of $32 on the Hank and Henry website right now. I know that because I looked that up. Um, this Becca lip liner. My best guess is it's probably in like the $18 range to $22 range. But I know because I went to TJ Maxx. I know they have these and they're selling them for like $5.99, so, you know, do with that what you will. There's itty bitty little tweezers, I guarantee you, they're like, well, the marketing price for this is, uh, 20 plus dollars. Girl, I could go get almost the exact same thing for less than $5 from my local Sally's Beauty, so. Up marketing much? I believe so. And last but not least, there's this Cherry Vera Pharmacy. My best guess, because pharmacy is kind of expensive, I'm going to say $26 to $35. I think that's a pretty good range for this. Obviously, I only know like the exact price of a couple items. Tell me down in the comments below if I'm wrong. Honestly, this box is better than the other box that I got. So as far as base box goes, the second base box is my winner for this month. So ding, ding, ding. However, I got this in my other base box. This is the hair girt, um, hair mask, and I used it and 
it makes my hair so soft and it smells amazing so if you have a chance to get your hands on this bad boy right here 100 percent do it you won't regret it especially if you have really really long hair you know like i do it's a good option for you but um that's pretty much it this is the $25 a month box. If you're interested in trying BoxyCharm out, I have a link down below that you can click on. Don't forget to definitely go to their front page as well because they often have a code that you can type in and get a free gift with your box. For $25, trust me, you more than get your value. Honestly, I would even give it a try for one or two months even if you don't want to keep it all year round like I am. So. Goodbye, guys. See you later. I will see you actually in a couple more videos, probably with this same makeup, because I got a couple other to film today. I got a couple Ipsy bags that came in the mail besides just this bad boy. So, bye, beautiful. I will see you in the next one. Feeling blue without you. Give me one more chance, give me one more dance. Yeah.